Vultures are a very important bird group. They're there to help clean up the carcasses that have passed on and keep disease down. The vulture populations, including condors, is the fastest declining bird group in the world across all continents. 70% are threatened or endangered, and their numbers have been declining significantly in the last few decades. Vultures are susceptible to the same thing worldwide, so we're all fighting the same battle in a different place, whether it be lead poisoning, power line collisions, the wind turbines taking out birds. You know, we all have to work together to say, hey, what solutions do you have to minimize the impact of these human-made problems? In the 1980s, we were down to 22 California condors in the entire world. So zoos such as Los Angeles Zoo came together to breed these birds to contribute to the wild population. And now we can see as a result that the numbers are up to 463 individuals as of December of last year. And we will contribute towards the wild population until it can sustain itself. The Arnado Grant has been really amazing for some of the keepers here at the zoo. It allows us to go after knowledge uh, and education to help us with our jobs here. So for me, it came down to being able to attend a conference in France that was dedicated to bringing back the bearded vulture there. Well, the bearded vulture is iconic to European countries as the California condor is to United States. Before I even knew I was going to be fascinated with the bearded vultures, I started watching videos on their reintroduction program and they were dropping into the nests, dealing with the chicks. I thought, gosh, this looks just like what we do in our program. I would love to hear more about it and see how it applies to our California condors. When you meet with other people that are doing a similar job, you can bypass some of the hardships by talking to them and figuring out what you can do to avoid that in the future. Some of the information I learned on incubation I feel is very valid and, and I do want to apply it here at the Los Angeles Zoo. I think it'd be very valuable and I've been even sharing this information with other California condor propagators at other facilities because I felt it was so important to consider your numbers could decline significantly if you're not communicating and sharing ideas on how to best, you know, get a bird back out into the wild. So there's a lot of good information being exchanged that can really speed up the process of recovering these vultures. I'd like to thank Dominic Arnato for the opportunity. Working together with other vulture experts, we can bring these birds back from the brink of extinction. Well, I think the exchange of ideas is extremely important. And when we have other keepers that specialize in other vultures throughout the world, and they share information, this is so important it broadens knowledge, and with the knowledge, we're able to help our animals. This is all a positive thing.